Jeff Kia, tell me a little bit about the sign you've got along the freeway. Well, you know, Scott, recently we've been, as our law enforcement has been encountering criminals that are coming up from Harris County. When we stop them for crimes that they're perpetrating upon our people up here in Montgomery County, what we're finding is they're asking this question. Are they in Montgomery County or are they in Harris County? And when we inform them that they're in Montgomery County, I gotta tell you, man, they flip. They begin to cry, they begin to whine, they start to cuss, and do you know why? Because they know that because of what we do here in Montgomery County, they are gonna pay the price for the crimes that they commit coming from Harris County up into Montgomery County, and we are not gonna let it go on. You see quite a few coming into the jail, which arrest for Harris County, I mean, the warrants out of Harris County, quite a few of them. What the, um, it seems like- Well, it's happening because there's a crime wave going on in Harris County. You can't turn on the news in the morning without hearing about some shooting of, of a young child, of a police officer, or some other constituent of Harris oh, County. Not... And it's starting to come this way. And you know, I'm not an officer of the law, I'm not a sheriff, I'm not a district attorney, I'm not a DPS, I'm not a constable. But what I am as county judge is a mouthpiece for the people of this county. And we are proclaiming that right now, we, are, we want this to stop. And we want Harris County Crime Wave to stay down there and not come up here with us. Because we will prosecute. We fund our law enforcement and we will prosecute. Hi, I'm Mark Keogh.